terrible, 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 what? Arnie, terrible, Arnie, terrible, Arnie, stop, terrible. stop, stop, stop. What is going on? Oh, hey, Tanner. Hey, studio audience. Glad you guys are here. Terrible, terrible, what? terrible, what? terrible, Arnie, terrible. Arnie, Arnie, Arnie. Please, please tell me. What assignment has you acting like this? Well, listen, you can see, obviously, Mr. Tanner, I'm supposed to finish all my homework, but I'm stuck on this one assignment, and I'm so bored. You're bored? Ow, ow, Wait, ow, 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 ow. Artie, 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 please, please stop. Please oh. stop. Mr. Tanner, I'm supposed to come up with an original story. An original story? Yeah, an original creative story, you know, to practice this much big idea of creativity. But I just can't do it. I'm not creative. Can you guys say this after me? Creativity. Creativity. Using your imagination. Using your imagination. To do something unique. To do something unique. But the mm -hmm. problem is, Tanner, I don't do stories. I only read books that have movies made from them. And by read books, I mean I watch the movie, and then I say I've read the book. <laughs> That's how I do it. Well, Artie, everyone loves a good movie. I yeah. mean... I love a good movie. But, I mean, we can also be creative when we read and write. So you're saying by reading and writing and trying new things and learning from people, I can work out my imagination and practice creativity? Well, that's exactly right, Artie. Well, you think these kids would be willing to help me use my imagination? Oh, I for sure. You guys want to help Artie out? Yeah. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, so here's what I need. Um, you guys are going to have to try to picture it. Because I'm going to imagine it. All right, so I need you guys to help me come up with a simple story. I need a hero. Some, a hero. It, it could be a person. It could be a, it could be a thing. It could just oh. be something random, like a, like a, a lollipop. Oh. It could be, it could be, it could be an animal. Okay, just shout some things out. What do you guys think a hero could be? <laughs> a tiger. Yeah, let's do a tiger. All right, let's do a tiger. I like that. Okay, okay, no, hold on. I got to use my imagination. All right, all right. Okay, okay. Shh. I think I could see it. A tiger with a, with a nice little kitty cat smile. Oh, oh, yeah, and you know what? He's super brave, too. Super yeah. brave? Yeah, he's a brave tiger hero. And he oh. needs a good name, like, um, uh, oh, I know. Oh, uh, Sir Striped Legs. That's pretty good, because tigers have stripes. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's yeah. True. Sir Striped Pants, like all good heroes, needs a villain. Oh, I need that's somebody. True. So something uh, something kid-appropriate, please. Uh, but a <laughs> villain, okay? Nobody name a politician, please. <laughs> all okay. right. Let's Just see. Kidding. All right. What do you guys think is a good villain for our A good Let's villain for our Let's story. Hear. I heard a giraffe. A giraffe! Someone said a giraffe. Oh, yeah! Yeah, that's good, that's good! I could see a giraffe. Oh, yeah, he's got a super long neck. And you know why, Mr. Tanner? Why? Because he's busy looking down on everyone. Oh. And not in the height way, he just thinks he's better than everybody. Uh -huh. Yeah, and so that's why I need a good name. Do you have a good name for the giraffe, Tanner? A good name for the giraffe? We'll yeah. call him... How about... How about oh. the the Baron von Stomp, uh, Baron Baron von Spot? Uh, he's got an evil plot. Uh, mm. He's gonna put all the food up high so that nobody can have any but giraffes. Isn't that horrible? That's horrible. Yeah. So okay, uh, listen. It's gotta be a nice way, but we gotta figure out a way for Sir Striped Pants to stop Baron von Spot from hiding all the food up high where only he can eat it. Uh, what's a good way he could stop him? Let's yeah, just see. shout it out. Shout out some random stuff. What's a good way, guys? What? A what? They're saying climb the tree. I don't. I don't know if that yeah. works. Yeah, I like that. I like that. He climbs it. So yes, yeah, Sir Striped Pants. Uh, he he gets ladders for everybody. Oh. And, or you know what? No, no, no. He gets stilts for everybody. Stilts? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and he sends them out, and Baron Von Spot plans to hide all the food up high, but uh, the Sir Striped Pants, he puts some striped stilts on, and he can reach the food that's really up high. Can't you just picture him? The giraffe, wow. uh, uh, you know, the giraffe would be all sad, but Sir Striped Pants, he'd be standing there all victorious. Happy that he has his super stilts on and he's eating a 
He's eating a piece of cake. A yeah. piece of cake? Because cake's great. Thanks for helping me tell that story, guys. Yeah. You know, I really think I've got a good outline. I, I might be able to finish this uh, by myself now. Well, Artie, that's exactly right. You did an amazing job, and you used your imagination. So you really think I'm creative? I think you are. You know what? Everyone is creative. And, you know, a lot of us might think that we aren't creative. But when we read and when we write and when we especially did what you did, Artie, and ask other people for help who are creative, right, they help us be more creative ourselves. I guess, Mr. Tanner, the truth is, if we want to maximize our potential, we need other people who are like us but are also completely unique. When we combine our different strengths and weaknesses, it can help us stretch and build our imagination, just like you guys did for me. <laughs> That's creativity. It's very cool. A creativity, using your imagination. To do something unique. Hey, everybody. It's Ask Artie, where real kids just like you from our studio audience get to ask Artie a question. So what do you do when you are scared? Oh, wow, that's a good question. What do I do when I'm scared? Um, well, you know, I think sometimes when I'm scared, uh, I, I'm scared of something just because I don't quite understand it. So I try to learn a little bit more about it. And that sometimes can help me. Or um, sometimes I'll tell an adult that I trust, like Mr. Cody, and he helps me not to be afraid. 